Does Elon Musk Really Pay His Taxes? Elon Musk, the founder and CEO of Tesla and SpaceX, responded to U.S. Senator Elizabeth Warren's criticism that he is freeloading off everyone else by announcing that he will pay more taxes than any American in history this year. Warren had criticized Musk for being named Time Magazine's Person of the Year. Musk said he would pay more taxes than any American in history this year. On December 20th, Musk tweeted, I will pay over $11 billion in taxes this year. This is a figure near CNBC's projection of $12 billion from the previous week and will be the greatest sum Musk has paid in taxes to this point if he meets his pledge. The Internal Revenue Service is the only organization with access to the accurate response to this question. Hello everyone and welcome to another video on our channel. In today's video, we're going to discuss, does Elon Musk really pay his taxes? So stay tuned to find out. Now let's start our video. To this point, Elon Musk has paid an astonishingly small amount in taxes. As is the case with a large number of other billionaires all across the world, Musk has paid essentially no taxes. According to the findings of ProPublica's investigation, he did not submit any federal income tax returns in 2018, even though his fortune increased by around $14 billion between 2014 and 2018. He only paid $455 million in taxes. How much did he get away with before anyone noticed? The individual currently holds the title of world's richest and does not get a salary or any other form of financial bonus, even though his immense wealth is over $243 billion. When he needs money, he uses his significant interests in SpaceX and Tesla to secure loans from financial institutions. Before he sells the assets or realizes them in any other way, he will not be required to pay any taxes on capital gains. Therefore, why is he handing over money at this time? When the CEO of the most valuable automotive company in the world paid at least $593 million in taxes in 2016, he did something similar, exercising Tesla stock options that were set to expire in August of the following year. These options were set to expire. Musk sold stock this year to lower his overall tax burden. Following a vote on Twitter on November 6th, which may or may not have influenced Musk's decision, he started selling stocks the next day. Between October and December, he had sales of nearly $13 billion. Forbes reports that a tax liability of $8.3 billion has already been incurred directly. In addition, he will undoubtedly be responsible for paying back taxes because earlier this year, he sold many properties and replaced them with a cabin that is only 400 square feet in size. and is located close to the SpaceX site in Texas. If you're liking this content so far, please consider subscribing and liking the video. Now, let's continue. Musk's tax liability is expected to be $15 billion this year, and a sizable portion of that will come from the sale of stock options that will become void in August 2022. In August 2019, Musk's stock options in 2012 will become invalid. Before he's allowed to turn his profits into cash, he's required to pay income tax on them first. Musk's income does not originate from a salary or a cash incentive. It is generated via stock awards and rises in Tesla share price. The price of Tesla stock is still up 28% for the year, even though it has decreased after Musk's Twitter poll. Musk can always get a loan and put the company's stock up as collateral if and when he finds himself in a financial bind. On the other hand, other legislators believe that this is just a way for extremely wealthy people to get out of paying their fair share of taxes. According to a report released by ProPublica earlier this year, billionaires like Musk did not pay any federal income taxes in 2018. According to ProPublica, Elon Musk paid $455 million in taxes on $1.52 billion in revenue, even though he increased the value of his fortune by $13.9 billion between 2014 and 2018. If the estimates provided by Forbes are accurate, Musk is by far the wealthiest person on Earth. Musk had the option of delaying the payment until the following year, but doing so would have caused him to be liable to potentially higher tax rates, in accordance with the Democrats' plan known as Build Back Better. Elon Musk, CEO of Tesla and SpaceX, has been involved in a heated Twitter debate with several prominent Democrats about the problem of tax avoidance. Musk responded to Senator Elizabeth Warren's criticism of his selection as Person of the Year by tweeting, I will pay more taxes than any American in history this year. If Musk truly pays that much in taxes, he may be true in his assertion. 
Well, that's all for today's video. Tell us in the comment section how this one was. I hope that you found this video interesting. You can subscribe and watch more videos on our channel to keep up with more content. We'll see you in the following video with some more notable celebrities, facts, and stories. And until then, stay tuned.